Hey dolls, welcome back to my channel. I was like, why are you so obsessed with me? So, it's another vlog day. Today's gonna be like a self pamper day, I wanna say. I have a wax appointment for 10 in the morning. Right now it's like 9.15, so I actually need to be heading out. I have a wax appointment. I have to get my lashes done. I also have to get my toes done. I might not get my toes done today. It might be tomorrow, but definitely I'm gonna head out to my wax appointment soon. So it's not my first wax at all, but it has been a while. I did go back to shaving, which is so, 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 so bad. So I wanna get back into just getting waxes. So I'm gonna take you guys with me. Hopefully they let me film. I'm not sure if they will, but I'm going to try for you guys. And then I have lashes a couple hours after that. And then later I'm going to hang out with my coworkers on the beach. We're going to South Beach today. So I hope this is going to be an interesting vlog for you guys. I hope you guys are interested. Don't forget to like this video and I will see you guys when we get to the wax center. Okay, y'all, so I made it to the wax place and I'm so nervous. And it's so crazy because the days leading up to me getting a wax, I was not nervous. Or like even on the way, I wasn't really nervous. And then now I'm just like nervous because it's been, let me think about the last time I had a wax. Dang. Time really be flying. Like, all right, it's been like a year. Dang, a year? It's been a year. Um, it's been about a year since I got a wax, so do I even know what it still feels like? I don't know. From here, let me show you guys. Let me show you guys. So I'm definitely here and it's definitely about to get real. Yeah. So my appointments are ten o'clock and they open at ten o'clock. It's nine fifty nine, so I might as well start making my way to the door. Let me grab my Let's go. Good morning. How are you? I'm good. Where are you having now today? Um, the Brazilian. Okay. Chance mm -hmm. Street. Okay. What is it? Okay. So, give me. The wax place. I have to sit on a bed. Just a moment. Oof. No. Oh. You okay. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah, on Tuesdays we're closed. Ah, really? Yeah, everybody gets to be off. Look at that. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I was nervous I was, I was all this sweat uh, and I was bleeding. But we'll talk more when we get to the car. Oh my goodness. I did not remember that pain. And I literally sat there and I told my friends like, y'all, it don't hurt. At, like, you know, it don't really hurt at the first time. It don't hurt, da, da, da. Yo, I did not remember it's been a year. And um, painful. I had to stop recording because your girl just 
I just couldn't focus. I was like, I was trying to process the pain. And then, you know, she, she tries to talk to you so that she don't really focus on the pain, which is really good. And that's why I love coming here. And that's why I always book with the same person because she makes me so comfortable. And she always finds something to talk about. And I just love that so much. So yeah, I also did decide this time to get the butt strip, which a lot of people was like, it's not that painful. I don't know. I, maybe I got more sensitive because like as you guys can see in the footage also i was bleeding a little bit so i think that my skin just got really sensitive you guys can tell from like the look in my eyes you know you guys can find out come on now you guys can kind of feel me from the look in my eyes oh yeah that was my waxing experience one thing that's very important after you get waxes is to moisturize and yeah just make sure it's moisturized because i've heard i've watched other waxing videos with girls where they have bad experiences so what i would say is after you get a wax i usually shower to get the rest of like the residue of the wax off and then i use like witch hazel down there and i'm going to use a little bit of shea butter you don't know how your skin's going to react so you want to you know make sure that you're just keeping it clean and keeping it moisturized so that was just my little tip for you guys. I will see you all when I get to the nail salon. This is my first time coming here. And I'm actually very picky about nail salons, but I'm on a time crunch. So, hopefully I like my toes. Hi, can I get a pedicure please? Okay. My toes look so bad. Y'all, I'm so mad. Like, I just made to my last appointment. Oh, I gotta pee so bad. I, and why I'm walking out the car, and the lady like, oh my gosh, there's a lizard on your hair. I'm outside going crazy. And just let it be like, oh, I'm just, oh, my bad. I'm just playing here. It's a stick. Like, you know, this. I knocked this whole shit off my head. Like, <sighs> like mad is an understatement, but... I think my lash lady's mad at me, so I'm just gonna go and get my lashes done, and I'll see you guys when I'm done. Take a good look because your girl is about to get sleep. Hello, it's me. I love my lashes so much, as always. I'm just not cursing. Let me help and get in my car. But, oh, that's very much ghetto. Let me get in my car. Hold on, y'all. I need to find my car keys. All right, y'all. Your girl is back and all the way live. Okay. Don't play with me. Oh my gosh. I love my lashes so much. I'm just trying all different. I'm just trying. All kinds of new stuff today. Like I'm to a different eyebrow person. Somebody who was just like, like I was just driving and I just stopped somewhere because I really wanted my toes done. And I was like, you know what? Let me just trust somebody else to do my eyebrows. Now look, eyebrows snatched. Okay, toes look good. This is my first time doing hybrid. I usually just do classic sets where it's just like the single ones, but this is like volume and classic mix. And she, like she did her thing. Like she really did her thing. My lashes look good shout out to eyelash eyelash obsession i'm gonna put her name on the screen because why not i'm a lash tech she's a lash tech support black businesses support small businesses so yes eyelash obsession here in miami florida oh my goodness like my lashes just look so good so yeah um i'm so excited that i'm on a good schedule i'm so happy my toast is done my lashes are done, eyebrows are done, wax is good. What's good? So now I'm going to head home. It's two o'clock and we have to meet for the beach at three. So I will see you guys when I get to the crib.
Okay guys, so we made it to the beach. I'm gonna go meet up with my friends. I'm always the last minute one. It's so calm and beautiful. Yes, I'm vlogging. <laughs> Say hi to my vlog. It's my friend Harper, guys. You guys, follow my YouTube channel, okay? At Harper's World. Yeah. It's going to be in the description box. Harper, where's the umbrella? Oh, I left in the park. Am I getting? <laughs> Excuse me, how much is the banana boat? It's thirty dollars per yeah, person. Oh, okay. I do it twice. And a jet ski? It's ninety every half hour per jet ski. So we can't get on the banana boat and we can't jet ski because we came out here too late. So definitely next week we're gonna try again. Chi Chi, we can't do nothing. It's already over for the day. They stopped an hour or two before sunset. Well, he I said don't, don't like they, the they already turned my everything into the office. I mean, I will post it because I don't see. care. But still, my tummy is sticking out. You forgot to suck it in. It still looks good, though. It, it doesn't look like you have a stomach for real. Yeah, but does it look like... So, since yeah, we can't I'll banana go. boat and just ski to get the umbrella... I mean, we're already here. Let me have a drink. Put some in here. I'm the non photogenic one. When all your friends want to do is take pictures, y'all see them? All they want to do is take pictures. Y'all, look at the scenery. It's so beautiful. Look at them, guys. This was supposed to be us, but we came too late. I'm gonna go put my phone down so I can get in the water. But y'all, it's such a beautiful day. Like I can't stop saying how beautiful it is on South Beach. I love it here. Woo! Okay guys, so I'm home now. Basically, um, we were just in the water for a little bit, you know, me and my friends, we talked, we shared stories, we prayed in the water. I know some people is probably going to judge us for going to the beach during this time, but honestly, me and my coworkers, we work like 60 hours a week, like we're essential workers too, and working that many hours, it takes a toll on you, so that beach day was well needed. It really helped us let go and just be carefree in the ocean. We still were social distanced, we didn't surround ourselves with with nobody else as you can see it was just us three together in the water and on the beach and stuff like that when we went to eat we had our masks and everything but working those many hours it really takes a toll on you and that beach day was well well needed and trust me well deserved because if you come to our job you can see like we work hard I just wanted to say that really quick because I know it's going to be those negative Nancy's who probably have something to say, but it is what it is. So, yeah. So, it's been a very long day, a very productive day. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Thank you so much for watching my video. Don't forget to like, comment down below, subscribe to my channel, tell a friend to tell a friend to subscribe to your girl, and I will see you guys in the next video. I was like, why are you so obsessed with me?